Hello, this is Alan McNabb with Image Building Web Design, and in this tutorial, we are uh, going to show you how to use the Adapt theme, which we're using with this website. Uh, you can get the Adapt Responsive theme at wpexplorer.com. It's a great responsive theme, and I'm going to be showing you how to use the really simple gallery widget, uh, which you can download from wordpress.org. Uh, and it's a very flexible widget that you can uh, use on your website. All right, we're already in the back end. Of course, with plugins, uh, you just uh, download and install the plugin. Uh, and here's the really simple gallery widget. It's already activated. Uh, and of course, we go to Appearance and Widgets. And uh, we've got the uh, really simple gallery widget here. Of course, uh, if we wanted to bring another one over, we'd just drag it over, but we've already got them over here. In our sidebar, I've actually got six of them here because I'll show you what we are, uh, show you what we're doing. Uh, pull up a page here, and you see we've got a number of pictures that come up. Now, what we have uh, with the uh, widget is uh, we have it set with about, oh, probably 30 or 40 images. Uh, to uh, rotate them randomly. So uh, while on our website, uh, while you go to pay, while you uh, while you go to page to page, uh, different images will come up in these uh, in these slots. Uh, we might be able to reload it and see we've reloaded it and different images came in. Reload again and different images come in. So you get the idea there. Uh, so this is really very easy to use. Uh, we've got six of these here, and we've got the settings on each one the same. We don't have a title because we don't want any text above our images. We are, we've selected our images because some of them we don't want to, to use. Uh, just uh, selected them by IDs, and here are the image IDs just separated by, uh, by a comma. And um, I'll show you how to get the, the IDs for that in a little bit. Um, then uh, we have it just to show one image because uh, for the spacing here, it works out a lot better. For us, just to have uh, different widgets, they're spaced nicely uh, versus having it just uh, automatically put a lot of images in there. Uh, the image size, uh, we're using the medium and uh, it's coming in randomly. And that's really it. Um, of course, if you, when you're done with that, just save it. And right down here, we've got the exact same IDs. These really are just replicas of each other. And so uh, um, we've got the, uh, uh, the, the widgets there. They're all using the same old 30, 40 images, whatever it is. And uh, they, uh, they just randomly put those on there. Now to get these image IDs, you see right here, if you wanted to uh, you know, put a different set of images there, you can just go to your media gallery and just click on, uh, just click on any image. And you see the ID equals 489 right there. So the uh, ID of this image is 489. And that's one of our images that we have in the, uh, in the uh, widget. So anyway, uh, it's been nice to uh, be with you today as I've shown you around with uh, probably five or six uh, tutorials. The Adapt uh, Responsive theme, which is free to use, the standard one, does a great job. And also shown you a couple of plugins, especially with this one, we showed you the really simple, uh, the really simple gallery widget, which we use uh, with, our, uh, with our website here. Anyway, thanks for being with us and uh, look forward uh, to you uh, being with us again real soon.